Welcome back, Indie Game Fanatics. My name is Renaud Edo, and today we'll be continuing with my time at Sandrock. I am absolutely in love with this game. Just in the memory of something festival. Face of Memories. That's what we did. Today we got the Wishing Festival and the Fireside Meeting. I'm guessing because it's the end of the month. Close. And uh, I assume summer, which is where we started. Summer. Learning of the Yak Melon Fall. That sounds interesting. Also, the dance off is at the beginning of the fall, apparently. We gotta do some more commissions today. Sorry that got loud, apparently. Uh, we gotta do some more commissions today. From the church. Been informed by the Ateran government that the train service to Sandrock will cease indefinitely due to damage on the train tracks and bridge caused by the... across the... Donash Cannon Bridge. This directly affects our water supply as half of our water comes via Astra Sand Rock Rail Link. Town meeting will be held at 6 p.m. today to discuss how to deal with the events. Okay. I'm gonna go work on my commissions, which. It works at proper PT. So we really want to get more bronze bars. So where are we at now? Just 10, 14 points behind me in. There's no way we're not going to beat. I want to uh, reward. Commerce badge and all the other stuff. Let's see what we can do today. Hardwood planks. We know that's easy. Bird. Thirty-one. It's right there. Uh, you know what? We'll take the bronze bars because we're gonna. I already have ten, so technically I can, I can complete that mission. We're gonna go ahead and make the hardwood planks. Don't have them already. I think I do, though. Let's track. It's two missions. That'll give us an hour 60 points. Won't put us in second, but it will get us uh, 30 Z. Hardwood planks are being worked on. The bronze bars are done. Turn in the bronze bars. Howdy. Take it easy. Hello. See ya. All right. So, how long is this going to take? Another two minutes for the planks. In the meantime, let's go, uh, oh wait, no, no, no. Before we go, I know I need at least old parts to upgrade my, uh, scanner. What else can we use? I think power stones are another thing you need for upgrading the scanner. I gotta sell that shiny scorpion. We have the old parts on me. Yes, I got 23 on me. We got power stones on me. Uh, that hardwood planks. Yes, I already have six hardwood planks on me. We 
got more old parts here. Got more power stones here. So I'm gonna put. I really need to do another uh, of my stuff. I'm gonna put the festival badges away. Commerce badge. Put that away for now. by the church. Let's go turn in this mission and we'll go do some farming. Uh, metals. Thanks for the ride. the end of the row. That should guarantee us first place in the Sorry, third place. The Commission Guild. We would have gotten second, but I really wasn't focusing on uh, commissions at the time. I still need to look up how to upgrade my workshop. I mean, we're getting the airmen work table, so that'll be soon. I can get a lot more data disks, then I can spend more time or ensure that I'm constantly researching stuff. That would be helpful. That breaking this down for rubber scrap would be helpful. Wood pile. Why is it all just junk piles right now? Look at this. Metal junk pile. What does that even mean? It's just copper scrap? A lot of it? That's good for getting copper, I guess. That'll get me a lot of copper. I can just see how far I can get down in the mines instead today. Gather uh, just tin. I don't think I have any items on. Damn it, I know. So I can. Right, see. Treasure detector. Let's upgrade this thing, shall we? Need glass for that one. Our super enhanced battery scan for longer. Ultimate battery scan for much longer. Scan the area faster. Cool. Hyper focusing on show an outline and the name of the scanned object. Interesting. And then that upgrade too. So I think we're missing is upgrading the focusing lens. Otherwise, our scanner is nice and upgraded. Oh yeah, that's that's pretty cool. Oh. <laughs> I was not paying attention to that bomb. Totally my fault. Right, 
before I can start getting tin, right? interesting that it saves where you've previously like dug dug out in the level level. So we're just going to be looking for tin now. How am I still getting stuck here? Here we go. I don't have any energy left, but still. Nice to see what's down here. Some more tin ore. You can leave with the map, right? Right? <laughs> leave ruins, yes. Okay. I was gonna say, there's no actual exit there. That would have been terrible. Man, we went there for iron, we really didn't tin, we didn't really get a lot of it. Oh, we still got 47. We got 124 copper, 47. We can at least make some bronze bars out of that. More importantly, we got the scrap on the way there. We do need to cook up all that scrap. Go to the meeting first and then uh, deal with the scrap.
Kepsky about to, I was trying to roll into Them it. Them eaglers are out of control, picking apart our bridge. They're trying to destroy our way of life and drain our water hole. If it only stands the reason that their end goal is world domination and the end of civilization as we know it. I like that you can tell, like, that with the voice acting, like, yes, it's not all there, but they clearly focus, they're focusing on storylines, voice acting, and then the, like, just conversational uh, what moments. What you just said is wrong, Cooper. The Gigglers are just trying to survive. They likely fear us more than we fear them. Really? If and that's the case, why come they went and attacked your farm? Settle down, everyone. I think most of us are here now. Before we jump to conclusions, let's hear all the facts. Allow me, Burgess. Oh, uh, sure. I was pretty much done anyway. <laughs> People of Sandrock, the light has taken upon itself to test us with yet another challenge. Another menace to disturb the peace in this town. First, Logan and his gang, and now this. In the past, those Gigglers have hit us where it hurts. But we Sand Rockers, through love and determination, we got back up again. We tightened our belts. Every brother and sister here aided and received aid in kind. And then, we danced away our sorrows. We turned crisis into laughter. But I'm afraid, folks, this time, we cannot turn the other cheek. That bridge is our lifeline to the outside world. This aggression will not stand. Meanwhile, the Alliance Council in Atara, according to our representative Gregorsik, are sitting around in their big building, twiddling their thumbs, <laughs> sipping fancy tea, while Sandrock dries up into oh, no. a piddling hole in the ground. This is a local issue. Why should they care? Now we could just sit around and wait for them to get their act together and send help. You can tell there's a wandering NPC currently stuck on like one of the other ones because you can hear their foot like like they're trying to run. <laughs> they or can't. we could solve it ourselves. Way I see it, the course of action is clear. We send the Civil Corps into Gecko Station to clear the Gigglers out. Then, once the coast is clear, we send in our builders to reinforce that rickety bridge. We'll have our water supply back in no time. I reckon it's gonna be us or them. And from where I'm standing, it ain't gonna be us. Wow. I Talking about, I think, genocide here. To come up with a plan. And then we will act. <sighs> We will protect our sand rock. Sheriff, it's all up to you now. I like how Ch Sheriff just like immediately starts walking away. Oh, I got a plan? I got a pl Have I got a plan? Hmm, of course I got a plan. It's the best dang plan in this uh, Bufalia. You just gotta hammer out a few details. So you don't have any other ideas, do you? <laughs> Change our patrols in a way that should give the moisture farm more adequate coverage. Won't be seeing any more gigglers over there if we have anything to say about it. So long, partner. Okay, so I guess we gotta kinda wait for that one. So that's fine. Let's go get some bronze bars cooking. Any we can make. I gotta figure out how to make uh, glass, like ten of it. Not here. Not the furnace, which is surprising. Oh, I'm surprised we were able to make twenty bronze bars out of that. So many copper scrap here. 
like no rubber scrap. <laughs> Pick up all the copper scrap tonight. Alright, so what do we need now? Need bronze bars we're working on. Copper sticks we can work on. We need three of those at least. Need more copper bars to do that. Rubber tubes, we need more rubber. Cycler and grinder is the only way to do that. So we need more rubber scrap. We're gonna be visiting the uh You know what? There should be some rubber scrap out here. There usually is some hanging. All correctly. Aha! But I don't have the stamina. Alright, so we'll come get that in the morning. Some rubber. Some rubber scrap going. And we'll head back into the mines after. Clear up our inventory first. Bombs out. Really don't need books on me. Ooh, condensed power stones. Those are one of the things I need to upgrade uh, my stuff. Why not? It's the dregs. And... Cool. Now we got a bunch of space. It's beautiful to see. bed. It also do is get rid of so that we're not carrying one of every weapon type. We don't have any more storage right now. I could I could make some. I have plenty of wood. Hey, there's, there's my favorite builder. Got a minute to chat about the workshop rating. Need to relay a couple things your way. Sure. All right, so here's how we're going to do your evaluation. It's something I like to call the compliment sandwich. That's where I'll say something nice, then give you a bit of a constructive criticism, then finish off with something that well, compliment compliments. Let's see, uh, well, you're not the worst builder I've ever seen. Ah, right, whew. Oh, that's out of the way. Workshop rating is ranked three this month. Renault, unremarkable in every way other than, I suppose, how incredibly average it is. Here in San Rock, we don't get by by doing the bare minimum. No, that's how we're, I mean, we end up in such a rut in the first place. We needed to see more from you. Pick up extra commission here and there, go visit town folks personally and ask if they need anything. Upgrade your machines and equipment so you can take on bigger commissions. I mean, just look at me and she's doing great. And well, on her way to be your boss. <laughs> uh, Mian came in fourth, Yan. 
Lucky if you, she's a friendly type. Go see if you can learn something from her, why don't you? Well, that about does it. Oh, we You'll get your second compliment in the mail. Goodbye. <laughs> oh, that's so stupid. Until that, Actimir is tasked the Civil Corps with killing out the Eaglers from the station across the canyon. The last night's fireside made the crew a formulated plan. We're going to need some builder magic to make it happen. Drop by our office soon. So we'll have to go visit the Civil Corps. Uh, we got our intermediate work table and our third place workshop ranking. So it's uh, nice stuff. Commerce badge and uh, a bunch of water again. Cool. Need any water in here? Now we can throw some in. What you have is we are finished with this for now. If I recall correctly, it should be able to upgrade my workstation now. I oh, know we still need the marble slabs from the Commerce Guild store. looking for looking for these all right let's go to the commerce guild store before we head out so we'll get the intermediate work table upgrade happening and we need to go get the rubber scrap first too Where do we level up level it up chop Improve machine production speed by another 10%. Alright, so marble slab. That. Power stones, I could get condensed power stones. Yeah, potted plant. That seems like a poor use of my uh, resources here. Go ahead and sell you. You have 40 data disks now, which is quite nice. We'll sell that. We are starting off this season. Ones to do. We need to figure out making glass. Twenty-five thin thread. Eleven thin. The glass. We need to make glass anyway. Go grab the rubber scrap. We'll do the commissions. Mills here for some rubber. And then I think there's some more rubber scrap back in this back corner.
thought there was. Marie's playing tricks on me. Alright, well, let's go get this rubber going. You can also get the marble slabs going, too. Marble brick. Need marble brick to make marble slab? Stone slab. I think that's the issue. I need the stone. Oh, we can make rubber tubes. Beautiful. Give me two more rubber tubes. All right. Thin thread. I'm pretty sure I have thin thread in one chest. Yeah, got that. And glass. How do we make glass? Right here. bunch of glass. We done that. So while that stuff is cooking, need marble. never have enough of anything now. Oh, dance-off's beginning. I don't go to complete in the dance off. <laughs> Hello. See you. We're looking for. Hey there. See you. Hello. Catch you later. We're gonna be good friends with her. <laughs> it's gonna happen. Can we do some workshop upgrades. Let's construction junction. Board, Akboy display board. Construction the strangest display boards baptized by the wind and rain. Only gain more charm as time goes on. That's considered a luck item. Home assessment board. He probably stuff. It's a home editing toolkit. That's what I need to buy. A toolkit that allows you to customize your home in all sorts of ways. Simply use inside your home to enter home editing. Stone, dinus, copper plates, and marble. Huh. 
buy some marble. Construction Junction Catalog. So do I like order things here to get upgrades? Stone house, wooden house, home expansion, windows. Okay, so yeah. Like if I do things, it costs money. Ah, but see, this is where you need to like buy and build things. So you need to have these already in your inventory. Iron planes, bronze flame frames, and then you can build a chicken coop, a barn, and a hutch. As structures. Cool. Okay, so now we understand that. What you need. Uh, iron plates, bronze flame frames, and hardwood uh, stuff. And start building these animal pen areas. We want to expand our uh, production area, obviously, first. Confirm. We're quitting building. Oh, cool. Okay. I'm just surprised the shop here is offers almost nothing. Hopefully that offers more in the future. If I perform in the dance off. Oh, they got another festival store. I don't have festival tokens for this yet, but I bet I can win some. Howdy there, partner. Can't say I recognize you. Uh, how do I compete? Dance, there we go. Okay. So let's start with, I guess, normal mode. Alright, press keys to the rhythm. When the game starts, names of buttons will slide across the screen from left from the left. Press those buttons to the music. Note, some keys you can just tap, some keys you might need to hold down. When the key reaches the circle in the middle of the screen, that's the perfect time to press it. Nail a bunch of moves in a row to rack up a combo. Big combos give huge bonus points. Short combos, short buttons just need to be pressed once, long buttons need to be held down beginning to end. Get more points with good rhythm and big combos. The person with the most points wins. Place higher in the competition to get better rewards. Okay. Oh boy. is uh more than i expected i still came in first but i definitely could have done better got 90 points for that one Which isn't enough to buy anything Let's go again.
It's a lot easier song, even though I picked normal again. Combo into normal ones mess me up a lot. Guys, yeah, so you have to tell me how my dance moves are because I can't even pay attention to it. All right, we crushed that one. Nice try, people. So we're losing the whole day to dancing. Um, I'm, I'm just sad that I don't have enough uh, tokens to buy some of these things. You get a boom box, which gives me plus nine to luck. That might be worthwhile. We can get some furniture to add my HP. I don't really need the HP though, so I'm gonna go with luck. Luck item. Take the boom box for now. Need to go get my glass so I can turn in that commission. Still can't make marble slabs. Need marble brick to make marble slabs, and I don't know how to make marble brick. Apparently. Should still be able to at least upgrade. No, because we need the marble slabs. Make the it though. Planting kit. Let's go complete our commission. Howdy. Hey. We need to go moisture farm into the civil court. Hey, the hydro gel is working great. Like I said, in a way, I guess you could say you saved a town. I Things see. are growing again. And with the Civil Corps on increased alert, I don't think we have too much to worry about from our scaly pals. Now might be the time to make good on my promise to Matilda and teach you about desert planting. First off, it ain't easy. Before you can plant anything, you gotta understand a little concept we around here call straw, the straw grid. grid. I won't bore you with the details, but basically the soil around here ain't good enough to plant much of anything. That is, unless you make a square out of straw around your seeds, protect them from the wind. Put a bunch of squares together and well, that's why we call it the straw grid. Okay. Here. Let me show you how to make a little straw fence in sandy soil. Then you just gotta plant a seed in the middle, water it daily, maybe add some fertilizer, and then... Wait, once your crop is fully grown, you can harvest it. Oh, if you plant often in the same place, your soil will retain some nutrients okay. and slowly upgrade, upgrade over, time. over time. That's about it. Um, if you have any other questions, I've actually written a guide on the subject. Okay. Flip through it if you get time. Here's some other stuff to get you started, too. Just, uh, do all those things, I said, and everything should go great. Try growing some sand For starters, rice. why don't you try growing some sand <laughs> All right, cool. else can get from the farm store? 
We got coffee, tea, tree seed. It'll grow into coffee and tea. We got cactus seed. Amada seed, rice, wheat seed, and leeks, straw, fertilizer, chestnut seed, rose willow, chestnuts, tomatoes, and potatoes we can buy from him. I'm sure those will be helpful once I uh, understand cooking. still don't know how to do because I don't have the stations for it yet. I haven't even made a drying rack. I haven't made a drying rack yet. Uh, I need to go to the Civil Corps. You're just in time. Everyone here? I'll get right to the point. We need y'all's help in the upcoming Civil Corps mission to chase off the Gigglers. Way I figure, taking the bridge into Giggler territory is a bit dangerous. We'd be walking into whatever traps they might have set up for us. They'd also see us from a league away. Plus, walking over that bridge lately gives me the willies. Them Gigglers have been taking pieces from the bridge for Peach knows what. I don't think it's very stable right now. Heidi, is there any way we could sneak over on that old trolley system behind the office? That way we can get in undetected. You mean the tram system left over from the early days of Sandrock? The two cables are still there, but we have a couple of problems. First, there are no tram carts. And second, the trolley engines are broken. Okay. Not to mention they're on the other side of the canyon. On top of that, we'll have to check the integrity of the cables. Okay, that was more than two things. But, uh, never mind that. Sounds to me like the first step is getting ourselves some tram carts. Builders, can y'all handle that? Yeah, of course no problem. we can, right? Why don't we each build one tram cart? Then we can manually pull ourselves over those engines on the other side and fix them up. I think it's doable. She still has some old diagrams from the early days in his collection. Let me go check and see if he's got one for the tram cart. I can get back to you on that soon. Yeah, sounds good. Thanks, partners. Just let me know when you're done. I hate to rush you, but well, without the railroad, I don't know how long our water will last. So do try to hurry. Okay. Now, how do we make them farm stuff for us? like I can buy quartz, bloodstones, and chlorite here, along with lots of really cute clothes with relics bags. But how do I commission them? Well, it's the case of the missing yakmel, the case of the lost teddy bear, the upturned heart incident, the case of the missing water, the list goes on. Ah, here. Oh, I can't. to be commissioned. Available from 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. Okay. Hey there. See ya. Back to the farm. Using the, your toolbox has unlocked plant desert planting. You can now go into planting mode in your yard from your action wheel. You don't need the toolbox anymore. Activate. 
And using your tool on the ground to make a straw square or place soil. Next, choose a seed from your planting tool and use the action bar near straw square to plant it. Bar your plants by selecting the water icon. Crop is fully grown, move close and harvest it. After harvesting the plant, leaves find nutrients slowly improve the quality of soil. You can pick up this improved soil and move it too. For the plants and soil you don't need that you don't water, select the shovel tool and then click them to remove them. Be careful though, they will really be gone and won't enter your inventory. To make planting easier, try upgrading your toolkit. Then when you use your tools, you can activate and hold to plant water, fertilize, and harvest more plants at the same time over a larger area. That's cool. Alright, so we got the boom box. We're gonna put that in our house. Get all the stuff from here. Make some bricks, shall we? And make marble bricks. That's what we need. Marble bricks so that we can make the um, intermediate workbench. Okay. So we are figuring stuff out. It's going pretty well. Got a bunch of farming stuff on us now. Uh, let's go put our boom box away. There we go. Should give us some extra luck. Yeah. Expand the yard. Cost 3,000 goals. How much do we have again? 4,500. Sure. Now my yard looks ridiculous. That's okay. Alright, so we'll fix that up next time. have any new items I would like to hold over my head this photo because our clothing has stayed the same. I like how I got those jeans and then within a very short period of time I switched them out to see the memories. <laughs> I got that instead. Man, we can make it about the fact that uh, we don't got much water. Uh, hold the water over, I guess. Picture with the water. Raise water. Can I just like stop and yawn? Hour. Okay. Guys, that's gonna be it. We're ending just a couple minutes early, but considering that we played like a half hour earlier the previous one, um, I don't mind that. Yeah, we'll continue this hopefully soon, and I will see you next time.